The DPP's primary election is in a state of flux as mediation continues between President Tsai Ing-wen and her primary challenger, Lai Ching-de. Party Central has confirmed that the mediation process has been difficult and unsuccessful so far. Both Tsai and Lai remain determined to run on separate tickets in 2020. Meanwhile, calls are emerging from within the party for the National Party Congress to veto the result of the primary and draft a candidate of its own. Today, Premier Su was back at Taiwan Taoyuan International Airport on inspection. He expressed satisfaction over security measures that have kept African swine fever at bay. He also called on airport personnel not to let the guard down, as the outbreak was still not under control in China. <coughs> He is busy these days with his duties as Premier, but also with the events unfolding in his party's primary race. Su is one of the five committee members tasked with mediating talks between Tsai and her primary challenger Lai, who last week rejected the idea of sharing a ticket with Tsai. Analysts have floated the prospect of Tsai pairing up instead with Premier Su. There is no need for that, because right now I'm leading the executive yuan, working hard for the benefit of the people. We're working hard to get results, the ruling party's best results for our countrymen. That's a responsibility we ought to take up. Negotiations between Tsai and Lai have proven difficult. DPP chairman Zhuo Rongtai said some party members are looking into using the DPP's despot clause to nullify the outcome of the primary. For that to happen, one-fifth of party members must sign a petition. The petition would have to be approved by 60 percent of the DPP's National Party Congress, with at least half of the representatives present. If passed, the motion would negate the results of the primary, allowing the DPP to draft a different candidate. About that, I believe that the DPP's chairman, Zhuo Rongtai, will handle the situation appropriately. That mechanism exists as a last resort, in case there are any judicial problems or extraordinary circumstances related to governance. It's not to be used during the more standard primary procedures. Unless it is necessary, it will not be used. It's never been put to use before. Today, the DPP lawmaker moved to defuse speculation over a change in the election rules. Meanwhile, the primary continues, with both Tsai and Lai digging in for the long haul.